Hi, my name is Kamil and I'm the designer and producer of the Game Builder Simulator. Today we'll take a look at the contracts and sandbox game modes. For the release of the game, there are 10 contracts available in which you have to complete certain tasks. This mode will fully prepare you for free building in sandbox mode while also allowing you to improve your skills, making it easier to work on larger buildings. Let's go to the 10th contract and start the game. Great news, buddy! You get the chance to prove your worth! I'm not kidding this time! Our next task is much more demanding than the previous one. This time you'll have to build a whole house! Foundations, walls, interior, everything depends on you! Still you have to work based on the client's blueprint. Even so, it's pretty exciting! Come on, partner! We have a job to do! After appearing on each contract, we are greeted by the character, Bill, who tells us the details of the task and a short dialogue introducing us to the job we have to do. And now let's take a look at the skill tree. You'll need to do some tasks to boost your skills, but putting up three hollow blocks at a time is really making your life easier. But that's not all, there are also achievements waiting for you to earn, and we haven't forgotten about your diamond shovel. Just look how cool it is. The player faces tasks that he would face in casual gameplay, so if you go through the tutorial, you should have no problem with any of the available tasks. For those who skip tutorial, we have prepared some tips that will direct you to what you should do. This is a mode for those who want an imposed goal. Dig foundations, build walls, put in windows, set the angle of the roof, all at your request. And this is just an introduction because we are preparing something really cool for you. Partner! Great job! That was really something! Should I say the client loves his new house? Because he surely does! You deserve a holiday bonus, buddy! Don't worry, I'll remember to give it to you when the time comes. Now let's go home! I'm tired! After completing the task, Bill says goodbye to us with a summary and 2D animation that we managed to complete the stage. And now, after completing the contract, let's go to the most extensive mode in our game, which is the sandbox. Let's find a winter forest and get to building. We have to start every construction in sandbox with a planner. Let's draw a simple building, I'll start with load-bearing walls. We have some simplifications in the game, so you can quickly make a square building. Then I will put two types of partition walls, which are marked with yellow color. Now you will probably be surprised because we start with foundations again. Digging the foundation, placing foam work and reinforcements, then pour concrete into the foundation. Another step is to prepare the floor, which is, needs to be dug up, followed by a sand bed. This can be done in two ways, one with a shovel, which I don't really recommend as it can take a long time, and one with a wheelbarrow. Just pour the sand into the wheelbarrow and you can fill the space much faster. We go through the entire process of building a house from the ground up. Use a plaster gun to plaster the walls and that will be my favorite part, leveling the walls. Choose a skimming blade and level the walls with satisfaction. After the construction part, we go to the finishing touches. In Builder Simulator, after you plan and build your house, you can do exterior and interior work. In Sandbox, you have infinite money, so don't worry about your finances. Here, as in interior designer mode, we can paint walls, change floors, buy furniture, anything we like. But unlike in interior designer mode, you have to stick a shovel in the ground for the first time and build all the walls yourself. But hard work pays off. It can take several hours to build and finish the whole house and it's totally up to you how big you build it. Just remember to have the right dimensions when planning. That will be the end of the sandbox mode and contracts. In case you missed it, I covered a video of interior designer mode too. See you later!